it's a bit like asking a question, what's the difference between a car five, ten years ago and a car today? Uh, there's a lot of things that are very similar and a lot of things that are very different at the same time. And all of that is driven by what is possible with technology today that wasn't possible with technology five or ten years ago. So as we know, digital oil fields have been there for over a decade now, actually with different names, digital oil field, eye fields, uh, smart fields. But what, what is that? That was the concept where people actually uh, put it as a part of an operational excellence program. And they did the digitization part in it to convert the data from analog to digital. That was the major focus on it. And then they compared their operational performance within their own organization. Digital transformation is actually going beyond it. It's more innovative. It's actually going to change the whole way we actually do business. That means it changes the strategy of the business as well. When you go back and you think about digital oil field and all the different names it was known by a decade ago, one of what was at the core was the ability to get data from the well site, from the rig, and bring it in so an engineer or other petroprofessional could optimize decision making in a particular area. But now you have these underpinning platforms that allow you to not just solve a point solution as we did with the digital oil field, but to think about a process from the end to the end. Digital oil field is based mostly in workflows. So we are doing workflows to frack our wells better, uh, rewriting basically how we connect the different uh, operations that we have in the field with the planning, with the post-processing. The problem with the digital oil field is that, yes, we are the connecting the dots in one specific area, but that, is not, that doesn't belong to a larger ecosystem to a larger platform, to something that is going to allow this information and this value created to connect to something else. So whenever we think about the digital oil field, it's just uh, this small piece. Whenever we talk about digitalization, it's the entire ecosystem. So digital oil field is uh, you know, primarily about applying traditional industrial control systems and automation uh, to the oil field. And, uh, and that certainly has its, its role. Uh, but what we found really in digital oil field is that, uh, you know, the scale and the cost is, is pretty significant. If you think about how much uh, cloud computing has lowered the cost of infrastructure, the cost curve on these technologies has come down so significantly. And there's so many new technologies that are coming on top of them. Things like artificial intelligence, uh, drones or robotics, 3D printing that it really creates a different kind of perspective and a different kind of cost structure uh, that's going to uh, kind of help this industry really fulfill the vision of what Digital Oil Field set out initially. 